the Philippines' position as an island country on the Pacific Ring of Fire and close to the equator makes the country prone to earthquakes and typhoons. Yet, there is no stopping big investors to build multi-billion projects, particularly in Cebu, the country's richest province for five consecutive years, now transforming it to being a world-class destination. Cebu is truly the Philippines' queen city of the south. Here's the three multi-billion projects that will open in 2021. Isla de la Victoria, developed by UHRI, a Gokongwe-owned company. John Gokongwe is a self-made billionaire and a fellow Cebuano. It is located in South Road Properties, Cebu City, near Il Corzo. With 25 billion budget, the, it is the biggest project to date in South Road Properties. With 350,000 square meter, it will house bars, restaurants, mall, convention center, casino, park, theater, and no less than three hotels. It is named after a dedicated Cebuano, Jojo de la Victoria, who was killed in 2006 protecting Cebu's marine resources from dynamite fishermen. This is a 50-year lease of the land. Cebu City will own 10% of all profits made for the entire duration. After this, when the lease expires, the Cebu City government will own not just 10% but everything on the property. Emerald Bay Resort and Casino Developed by PH Resorts, Group Holdings, the gaming and tourism holding company of the Udina Group, headed by its president, Davao-based businessman, Dennis Uy, who tracked the completion of its new casino resort's first phase by the end of 2021. It is located in Punta Inganyo, Mactan, Cebu. With a budget of 650 million US dollar in a 13.5 hectare land, the first phase is expected to have 830 all suite rooms, a penthouse, a royal suite, five ultra luxurious villas, 7,585 square meters of gaming floor area, 1,186 electronic gaming machines. 146 gaming tables, 8,000 square meter of space for themed retail outlets, a convention center, and 18 restaurants. The second phase will open a year after it, covering 9,400 square meter of gaming area and a five-star hotel with 1,300 rooms. Cebu Cordova Link Expressway is an 8.5 kilometer bridge and a 30 billion project which will beef up Cebu's road network connecting Cebu City and Cordova Lapu Lapu City. Its iconic features is a lighted cross on all four sides on top of the two 145 meter tall main pylons inspired by Magellan's cross. The span and height of the bridge which is at 51 meters will allow large vessels to pass underneath and the link is expected to serve at least 50,000 vehicles daily with a design speed 60 to 80 km per hour. And the other four multi-billion Cebu project with a target completion date of year 2022 to 2028 are Metro Cebu Expressway approximately 73 km long with 28.1 billion budget. Ming Mori Business Park in Minglanilla, a 6 billion reclamation project in a 100 hectare land. Seaside Arena 
the SM Ayala Group will pour a total investment of $307.2 billion for the 26-hectare land and will have a seating capacity of 16,000. Last but not the least is the Sentosa of Cebu, a 1,500-hectare reclamation project in Cordova, targeted to be completed by 2028. Thank you.